Papa Gunner Reviews, Marvel's Ultimate Alliance, Gress. Papa Gunner Reviews are for parents, adults, and kids that want to enjoy things together. Let's see how Ultimate Alliance 3 stands up to the other two. For this review, my grade skill is going to be buy, try, pass. Let's get into it. I've been obsessed with X-Men lately, so I decided to buy the DLC for Ultimate Alliance 3. I've played this game before on my own. Now, my daughter is four year old, my oldest, so I decided why not play this again now that I have the DLC and play as the X-Men characters since I am obsessed with X-Men. The story is essentially kind of what the MCU did with the Infinity Stones, right? It is the Infinity Stones. It starts off as Guardians of the Galaxy. They're just trying to steal the Infinity Stones. Really, it was Rocket who was like, yeah, I found these stones. And then, then he tried to steal them. And then, of course, the Black Order shows up. And then it just goes haywire. And then it wraps up with everybody, right? You get the Inven Avengers wrapped into it. Spider-Man, everyone gets involved. And then even the X-Men get involved so it gets really crazy, and then you go into this dark dimension, Dormammu. There's all kinds of Doctor Strange. I love these games because they find a way to include the entire Marvel Universe. The comic book universe. Well, I guess video game universe. But the 616, I think, or whatever you want to call it, they include so much of it, and it's just a blast. It's also super easy to play with kids. It is essentially a button masher. My daughter essentially just wants to collect the blue and red orbs, which unfortunately are the orbs for health and special moves. So if I run out, she just steals them, and then she gets mad if I take them. But And I'm the only one that knows how to use the special moves, so she doesn't use them. But it's still a good time. We still are checking out the story. We're still wandering the world. We're still learning this stuff together. And it's kid friendly. It's kid appropriate. And it works. And it's great. And I love being the X-Men. My daughter loves the characters. My daughter has a blast because she plays the characters that she recognizes. Which is Storm because of X-Men. She also recognizes Nightcrawler. But that's my character. She does recognize Cyclops. But she wants Spider-Gwen on her team because that's her favorite Spider character. And then Captain Marvel. So for all the haters that are like, oh, screw Captain Marvel, she's an inspiration for, for little girls. So buzz off. Anyways, we have a blast playing this game. I, I like it. I enjoyed it. It does get quite difficult, especially if you don't use the special moves. There's some cool stuff in this. Yeah, it's not as good as the second one but it's still really solid and it's still pretty good and there are some great parts some the daredevil stuff daredevil kingpin level phenomenal i felt like i was playing a legit like classic japanese style game because they do like this silhouette thing and it's just brilliant so if you don't have it get it unfortunately it's only for the switch and the dlc is totally worth it because it's only 20 bucks and you get all kinds of extra stuff, Fantastic Four, more X-Men stuff, and more story, more characters. So totally worth it. It's going to have to be a must-buy for me. Tell me what you think if you've played it or if you haven't and why you haven't gotten it. Maybe it's because you don't have a Switch. Tell me. Talk nerdy to me. That's what that's all about. Talk nerdy to me. When I say talk nerd to me, that means you tell me what you thought of this stuff. Check out our merch at TNTMTheShow.com where you can get this merch on sale with free shipping. Maybe not the shirt, but definitely the jacket and the headband. As it is our Star Wars month, we're also doing X-Men, Doctor Who, and Star Trek. 5% of any profit that we make goes to our charity of the month, which for... Mayo is National Alliance on Mental Illness. So help us help them by buying the sweet merch or donating directly to them on any of our social medias. Talk nerdy to me.